Hi, I'm Evan Thomason for This Week in Santa Clarita. Right now I am standing with Ryan Drake, IT analyst for the city of Santa Clarita. Uh, Ryan, a while ago we launched a iPhone application for the city of Santa Clarita and we made some changes to it, made it a little bit more accessible to people. We did, yeah. Uh, about a year ago, we launched the uh, e-service application. Uh, that application was uh, combined with a bunch of other cities, so you had to select Santa Clarita and then go on from there. This new application is just for Santa Clarita. Um, and in addition to that, it's also now available for the Android. So for the iPhone and the Android, you can go to the App Store uh, or the Android Market, do a search for Santa Clarita, and uh, get the e-service uh, application on your phone. And I know we've heard a lot of feedback from people. It's very convenient. Talk about some of the features of what this application can do. Yeah, the, the regular e-service uh, that we have on the website, you can go in, you can put in uh, any questions that you might have. What this does is it takes the uh, e-service e application and makes it mobile. So let's say you're out, you see some graffiti, you can just go ahead, open the application, take a picture. Uh, the application automatically knows where you're at, puts a GPS location. Uh, you can put any other comments you want uh, into, the, um, into the request and then go ahead and send it and then I'll get it to the, to the right people. What are some of the other uh, f uh, common uses for uh, e-service? Uh, graffiti, uh, potholes, uh, you know, road conditions, things like that. Um, also transit, if you have issues with the transit system. Um, or even if you want to you know, send a compliment or something like that, you can do that as well. And we certainly welcome comments. Uh, and the potholes, too, is that something that you can, it'll focus on your GPS location, so it really makes it uh, easy for not only city staff uh, to find out where the problem exists, but also for the user to phone it in. Correct, yeah, it'll, it'll take the location. You don't have to worry about the address or anything like that. Automatically knows where you're at and makes it really simple to do. Okay, so again, people can find this by, it's, if people that use an Android or an iPhone find this how? Uh, just search for Santa Clarita uh, and you'll get a couple of options and it'll be on there. You'll see the, uh, the icon with the, uh, the city's tree on there. Just go ahead and click on that and it's easy to install. Ryan, I want to thank you. Uh, if you're out there, you got an iPhone and Android, a new application for you if you live in the city of Santa Clarita. Uh, for this week in Santa Clarita, I'm Evan Thomason.